I want to share this verse to you guys in Hebrews chapter 4 verse 16. But before I do anything, before I say anything, and before I share anything, I want to share first to everyone. How are you today? Of course, it's nice to say always, you are blessed by Jesus and highly favored by God. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. In Hebrew chapter 4, verse 16, in New King James Version, Let us therefore come boldly to the throne of grace, that we may obtain mercy and find grace to help in time of need. Amen? Some people make it seem like it's so difficult. Enter God's presence. And that you have to go through a process to get there, they teach staff like seven steps to the presence of God. And the good news is, what is the good, new, good news? The good news is there are no steps to God's presence. If you are a child of God, you are already in His presence. Amen? Amen. Why? Because Jesus collapsed the steps. And He forgave all of your sins. He forgave all of our sins. Past, present, and future on the cross. And went into the presence of God on your behalf amen so you are right now in the presence of god because of what because of jesus christ amen so you can come boldly to the throne of grace and receive mercy and grace amen to help you in your time of need Remember that God is there always to you, to us, to everyone. So we need to look to our God, to our Lord Jesus Christ, to our God the Father, and to our um, um, beautiful Holy Spirit. Amen. So that's my advice to everyone when you pray say thank you jesus thank you lord and claim it whatever you want to ask to god claim and believe 